hands me. Say your weekend and the weekend never stress a thing. And we gon' go another day when we don't disagree. And when the sun shine in, regardless if you do believe, hey. Celebrate in the morning when I see your face. Need you more when you go. I need you more every day. Keep a foot on the brake in case I lose all control. Yeah, so baby, don't lose control. I focused on you, baby. Lately, you've been in my aim. I've been reaching out for you and still that's so far away. Looking through the smoke in the mirror. Crazy how I see you so clear. Crazy how I see you so clear. And how you make me smile. And how you make me smile. Oh, yeah. And how you make me smile. Oh, baby, how you make me smile. Smile more when I see you. But I miss when I miss you. No, I don't want to be left alone. Oh, no. Good evening, everybody, which is not a way I start sentences all that often or start streams all that often. That's right, secret medium night, late night, surge after dark bonus stream where we are continuing. This is stream two of our Gaul playthrough. If you're not familiar, on Thursday earlier this week, how does time work? Uh, the latest Frontier Pass update came out, giving us the Gaul and Byzantium and I didn't want to have to wait until the next Civ stream to play more. So I made a new stream. That's right. I'm my own boss. And I'll play video games when I want to. I love you, Joe. <laughs> now, if you missed the first stream, let's do a quick catch up. The Gaul are very interesting. Uh, we are playing as Ambiorix. And what sort of abilities do we get? One, mines provide a minor adjacency bonus for all districts, which is very interesting. Every time you construct a mine, you get a culture bomb of unknown territory. Culture bomb, of course, means it expands the radius for every unoccupied tile around the mine, provided it's not too far away from your city. We found out the hard way that the culture bomb only works within the normal growth radius of a city. You can't just kind of mine infinitely. And all of your mines give you a flat plus one culture, which is just actually kind of sweet. That's just super cool. Now... Specialty districts, however, do not receive a minor adjacency bonus from each other and cannot be built next to your city. That really kind of messed us up. And uh, we'll talk more about that once we get into the game to see, like, the spacing of districts being different this game was kind of wacky. Uh, our unique district is the uh, Opidum, which is an earlier engineering district. It gets adjacency, it gets a major adjacency boost from strategic resources, which is really quite cool. And if you have walls, it fires arrows like an encampment. It's cool. And the uh, Gaisate, I believe is how that's pronounced, which replaced our warrior. 
Sorry, my window's open because it's warm, but it's also loud. Give me one second here. Yeah. So let's hop on in and let's talk about our game so far. So here is the state of the world. It is currently the year 2330 or turn 184. So we are rounding the corner into the mid game right now. We've just unlocked coal. We've had gunpowder for a while. And let's look at our relations right now. We're in an alliance with Byzantium, who's right here. We're also in alliance with Suleiman, who is here. Is this you? The Ottomans? Are you the Ottomans? Yes. So our allies are kind of close. We had a war with Japan, and then we got over it. Uh, Japan was kind of aggressively trying to convert us to Buddhism, and then that stopped. And now we're cool again. Yeah. Rush mining, build wonders with the early great engineers you want. That's basically kind of what we did. Uh, we didn't rush that many wonders, but we got a couple of the key ones. Uh, this is an important question comes all the time. Hey, Serge, how do you think you're going to win? The answer to that is um, diplomacy. We're going to try and go for a diplomatic victory for the first time ever. Now, a couple other things I think we need to do. I think we need to try and just pause everything we're doing in all of these cities and just get a couple more builders. And I think I've been a little bit silly and I haven't just spammed builders everywhere. Um, so I think every single city is going to make itself one builder after this. Uh, you've already got a builder on the way. You've got a builder on the way. You've got builders after the factory. You have an builder coming. Two turns. Choose a civic. Fantastic. Let's get a, let's get a um, new government going here. And what's one that focuses on industry? That's science. Influence, 7 influence at 200 points. So, okay, so that's basically the same. Earn 3 envoys. It's the same for envoys. Discount for buying stuff is kind of interesting. Inherent trade words with allies gives you food and production. Yeah, I mean, maybe we're going to be democratic here. Let's just go ahead and rush democracy. So how y'all doing, everybody? Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Any other questions before we jump into this too much? Oh, right. We want to change our government policy right now. And let's get rid of scripture. And we want to give ourselves the ability that our our builders have additional charges. Where is that? Where are my builders at? Builders? Ah, there we go. 50 product. Oh, bonus production towards builders and they have extra charges? Amazing. So our goal right now is to lean in on our um, specialty boost of mines and culture. And normally I'm not that eager to cover the entire map with upgraded tiles, but I feel as the gall, I'm leaving value on the table when I have all of these unimproved hills. So we're going to go ahead and just do that real quick. We do have to be a little bit concerned with things like volcanoes. Yeah, we want to culture bomb this one, so we're going to chop down these trees, give ourselves a mine. Why do you avoid improving every tile? Um, it's just not worth it as much in this game compared to other ones. Your production is really expensive, and oftentimes, unlike because of the number of charges you have on a builder, unlike in Civ previous versions, uh, it, it just doesn't seem as worth it. Also, there's enough natural disasters that can come and destroy everything that it's just not quite, at least I don't find it worth the investment to go in and upgrade every single tile in all your cities. Yesterday was super good. You're hyped for the uh, rustproof bee shed. Excellent. Excellent. I'm glad. Right, I've got some turns still before the next age. Yeah, in previous Civ games, you'd like make a bunch of builders and then just kind of put them in and out of cryogenic sleep. Right? All right. We're buddies up there. Hey, what's up, Evil? Thank you so much for Never 200 biddies. a rifleman until you've walked a mile in his shoes. That way, he'll... All right. Oil is coming soon. Excellent. Uh, let's go ahead and chop this down. And sometimes it'd be fine to keep trees. But I think for this particular playthrough, just because of the value we get from mines, we're just going to go ahead and turn everything into mines. 
University is important. Now, here's another really important thing we had in this game, is look at where we are in the world. We are now second place for science. We were so far behind, and we managed to catch up, and we're second place for culture. So I'm happy with all of that. Hey, what's up, Caffeine? Thank you so much for that half year. You miss Builder Cryo Sleep? One dude for all of history is kind of dope. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and get another alliance with Rome here. Okay. The main thing we're going for here is we just don't want anyone, anyone to ever mess with us. If they mess with us, they actually pick a fight with four countries. Thank you for doing the server tours. Been linking a bunch of my friends to show it off and building lately. Yo, that's awesome. All right. So check out the ability here. We build the mine and then we get access to all these tiles. Now it's great there. Oh, is we can now make our harbor. Hold on. Hold on. Why is this only a plus two? Shouldn't that be plus four? Because we have crab and we have fish. Oh, this would be a plus four if I had my city here. But because you don't get the city adjacency bonus, all my math is off. Right, of course. I mean, I guess plus two is still kind of good. And I guess I could put a trade district. Oh, I could put a... Yeah, I could put a trade district there. That's actually kind of cool. So let's go ahead and lock that in. And then we'll grab those two tiles to help the city grow faster. Yeah, because if I uh, give you money for no reason... Oh, right. The Dutch hate us. Classic Dutch again. Uh... Rowies in smoke. The first factory is built by yours truly. And what we want to start doing is just burning coal immediately. So you can see this time, I didn't actually get to culture bomb these tiles, which would be the expectation. And that's because one, two, three, we'd already hit the maximum radius of how far we could spread from this city. I guess what I could have done is if I had flipped this tile to this city, I may have gotten those two with a culture bond for this city. Which is a little bit unfortunate, but so it goes. We're still going to get a bunch of um, good passive energy. I want this to be a farm triangle. But first, more mines. Oh, there's a cliff there, so I have to go all the way around. I only have one build left. Okay, we're going to need a second builder up here. What's up, Winter Nightingale? Welcome. Have I not improved those elephants yet either? Interesting. Uh, is one builder going to be enough for this part of the world? You've got your own coming pretty quick. Yeah, we'll say, we'll go ahead and say that. It's fine. Uh, plus two. No, I don't care. Um, I am still unhappy. So an entertainment, no, um, a floating water park district. I think I'd actually lose Statue of Liberties. It's such a bother that I lose that there. That's such an important monument for us, though. Four diplomatic points. Is it worth losing? No, that's so many. Uh, four, eight, eleven. No, it's not worth it. This is just versus the AI. This is just a chill game via the computer. Harbor Statue of Liberty. I need to get more production in the city if I want that to work. We already have an entertainment complex here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so any bonuses from that aren't going to work. Water park? I think a water park is important. We are getting some pretty big penalties from lack of amenities. Armored Assault Possum. 
Thank you very much for 200 biddies. Happy to be catching a Civ stream live. Right on, friend. Ooh. Uh, always happy to get a free envoy there. Yeah, welcome, friends. All right, we just want all the mines all the time here. If we can make a mine, we're making a mine, right? Why am I here? Right! Oh, I forgot how greedy I was going to be. I'm just putting a city here, aren't I? Yeah, we're going to put the city... Was it right on the gunpowder? Hold on. Right. Oh, I forgot just the maximum greed I was going for here. So that, and then we're going to put a holy site right next to the Great Barrier Reef, right? Yeah, that was going to be rad. Um, great uh, holy site, that's there. And then th th this... This is also like a plus three science just by itself, right? One, two, three. Oh, if I go... Actually, no, that's not good. Uh, I want to put the city here. Because if I put it there, and then I put a... Uh... Sorry, nine? Nine. What? I was going to say... What? What an incredible improvement there. Oh, this has been flooding. So, um, if I leave room and I put the opidum there, that's plus four already, which is also kind of huge. Yo, what's up, bad panda bear? Thank you for 27. Okay, so I think I put it on the grass instead. Or, what if I found it here instead? So this is why it's really tricky to play the Gaul, because I can't have districts next to my city. If I found on there, do I keep those bonuses, or does it reset back to two and two? You know what I mean? Wow, that's wild. I think that's the spot we want to be. It keeps the bonuses? I need to find out. If I settle a city, do I lose the, re the yields? Yields is the correct word. The city center has no yield by default. If you settle on a tile that gives culture, faith, or whatever. With the exception of the city center, district tiles cannot be worked. Any Okay, so that goes away. You have transgressed their agenda? Hold on, what do you what do you want from me for gossip, Suleiman? Over here helps with the placement? How so, Kenta? Like what's the difference between those two? Alright, Suleiman, what what is gossip? Is it the loyalty one that you don't like? Uh gossip. Wants to know everything about everyone through friendship, open borders, delegations. Okay, okay let's be buds. There we go. There we go. We can be chill. Let's have open borders. Yeah. Let's have... Uh, you want to have a little alliance as a treat? Go back to being culture bros. There we go. Uh, anybody want to buy some elephants off me? See if I can't get some other luxury resources going here. You want a diamond for an elephant? Amazing. Uh, Suleiman we already talked to. How about you, Japan? What you got? Okay. Yes. Fur wait, are furs still bad? Okay, it won't trade me furs. Oh, I don't have fifty gold. That's awkward. Because you can't build in those places, those resources are still in play. What? Cross the river. 
I don't quite know what you mean, Kenta. Late night surge stream? Yeah, what's up, Evo? Look, I just wanted to play more video games. So... Alright, let's be real. If I can found on this city, the city starts to pop off. Um, the tile placement here and here are exactly the same. Minor, minor, plus, or plus one, plus one, plus two is plus four. This is plus two, plus two. That's also plus four. Next to the mountain makes it slightly more defensible, I guess. What's my loyalty at here? Do I have to worry? Loyalty is exactly the same between those two tiles. I guess this has the slight advantage of being not in a floodplain, whereas this is in a floodplain. So if I put the city here, it won't just die immediately, and then I can maybe get a dam in? Why not on the salt, Peter? It's the gall. Uh, as the Gaul, you cannot have a uh, a district touching your city. That's just the unique the unique play style of the Gaul, who just came out on Thursday. Thank you for bringing me tea, my love. Any plans for making channel points things? Oh, I'm not sure. Maybe if we just do like uh, more of a goofy Civ playthrough, we'll let people just start naming everything. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is another plus three right here, but uh, that doesn't... Plus one, plus two, and a river tile. Wow, more quarries? That's on a hill. Hmm. The gulls are weird. Yeah, they're kind of cool in a very weird way. I still think I'm just going to put them right here on the wheat. Because our starting tiles are <laughs> ridiculous. The city is going to grow so fast. The city is going to go grow so incredibly fast. What do you do with the tiles next? You improve them. You ignore them. Yeah. You're spending much time on research. Wait, you're not spending much time on research? I beg your pardon? Wait, oh, you got ahead of me again. No, barely. Bolshoi Ballet is hold on, hold on. Can we appreciate the smack talk I just got there? Uh, we're really lagging behind on science there, eh, Wilhelmina? Just, just a mile behind you. Must be tough. Being so ignorant, forehead. That's that's her talking to us. You know what, Wilhelmina? Fine, I'm taking Auckland from you. Shallow water tiles you own provide plus one production? What? Hold on. Look at this right here. That's absurd! Oh my god! Look at these tiles! What? Yo, just added? Added to the fact that we have the mausoleum down here? That's absurd. That's absurd. He's popping off. I'm sorry, what's that? Another mine? But sir, we could build a farm. Silence! More production. Ah. Uh. Uh, this is going to be a farm triangle because I am running low on houses. And if you can get them in a nice triangle, you get an even bonus, bigger bonus yield to everything. Alright. Uh, RV, move over here. New city. Alright. What's that? A mine, you say? And we can walk this mine all the way over, which is going to be amazing. We're going to start with production here, because we got this plus four. And then as the city grows... <laughs> Look at this! 
Look at the starting tile it gets to work. So this city, for starters, already has plus 10 food and 7 production on the first turn it's founded. What? Oh, man. Uh, oh, right. I forgot that somebody killed Reyna. All right, Reyna, we're going to put you back in Novo over here. And we get a promotion on a governor. Hold on. Where are you working right now? Magnus. Magnus, are you in a city that's going to be providing power? Magnus, where are you? Ma Ma oh, Magnus is over here. The city does not have that. Am I going to be chopping anywhere? I guess I could put Magnus up here. All right, Magnus. Go, go live up in the north. And then what we're going to do... 20% growth in this city? Yes. Like, I want this city to grab... Or to grow, pardon me, super fast. What's that? Another mine? Like, when we upgrade these tiles, isn't that incredible? I feel like I wasn't... Playing this properly. I wasn't playing the civilization properly. But now... Oh, yes. Can you feel the power? Another alliance expired with whomst? Suleiman. No, we fixed that already. Uh, somebody finished the Taj Mahal. Your cities require additional housing. Seems like we fixed that? Oh, no, we sure did not fix that. Uh, you know what we need? Build another builder. That's right. And actually, once that's done, aqueduct is probably a good call. So, the volcano aqueduct? No, I guess we're just going to have to wait for neighborhoods for this city. Oh, right. You know what else we can do? As if this city didn't already have a busted enough start. Let's pray for... Let's just pray for a couple things here. We can just pray for an infrastructure. Good start. All right. So our turn one city has 13 food and uh, 8 production. Cool game. Your people are settling too close. That's fine. What? Catherine's yelling at me too. Where are you even? Oh, are you there? Hold on. I'm at war? Wait, what? Uh, build two coal power plants. All right, let's actually change off that tech because we're going to be grabbing that pretty quick. And let's try and get Oxford. Uh... This city needs housing. I could put two farms there. Again, I'm a little bit worried. So what we're going to do instead is... How many actions do we have? Not a lot. Oh, a naturalist. Wait, do I care about... The parks only give you... Um, tourism, right? They don't give you... Oh, they give you amenities! Yes, please. Is there a national park? I guess I could put one here. I desperately need amenities. So check this out. Three, three, four. Oh, I can't do that yet. We'll wait next turn for that. Is that another mine? Let's go get that luxury resource. Let's go get that fish. Oh, 
Oh, wow, yeah, they're right here. Okay, I can see why they're upset now. Require additional amenities, that's fine. Permanent coastal flooding. Suzerain status lost on Nan Medal. Whoa. Black Betty, Nan Medal. Okay, Ferris Wheel is going to be great. Uh, Sydney Opera House must be built on the coast adjacent to land and a harbor district. All right, where can I build a national park? Wait. I can only make one? Okay, well, this city needs help as well. So I guess I'm actually kind of happy to head down here and just make that happen. I guess I'm glad I never improved that, uh, that coal. Because we're going to lose it forever. Alright, so... See how that's three and three? Now if we build this farm, because it's in a triangle, now it's four, four, four. And that gives us some more um, some more housing for these cities as well, which is always good. Oh, I actually don't want to work that tile. Hello! You pray for my soul. Thank you. I take it that means she's a friend, right? Uh, many dispute the actual start of the modern age. We've developed Engineer, refining. The Wait. The great... I thought I changed that technology. Uh, do I have oil? I have a bunch of off... Wait. Alright, hold on. Do I have any on-land oil? Am I already harvesting oil? Okay. No. 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 Yeah. Yeah. That's it? Okay. So the only oil within our border right now, there's two sources in the water, and I'm almost tempted to plop another city right here to grab that, but I also promised Japan I wouldn't do that. Um, I do, however, think... that uh, the game is going to grab that tile next after. The game's pretty good at prioritizing resources. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to go for diplomacy, so I'm trying to keep everybody happy on me. What's up, passerby? Uh, how's this city doing? If I wanted to put an aqueduct down... Oh, I could put one in this tile I wasn't using at all. <sighs> what does that do for me? Do I care about anything else? These wonders don't actually help me. Uh, more population helps me. Pounded at some skirt steak. Marinating in sesame oil. Oh. Oh, jeez. Hi. Uh, do I care about the Hagia Sophia? I definitely do not. Um, any other districts I care about right now? Not really. I guess I could just do Renaissance Walls and then maybe another Spy. Again, for the glory of the Empire. The Venetian Arsenal, receive a second naval unit, doesn't seem good on this map. Does get us more great engineer points, though. And we could want all of the great engineers, which would be kind of sweet. Uh, we also need more amenities over here. So actually, what I think I'm going to do... Let's just double check that there's no tiles that we care about here. That's only plus two. That's only plus two. So I think I'm going to put an entertainment district here. Um, and what that's going to do is give me amenities for these two cities. 
So this one should be taken care of. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. No, this city's a little bit too far. Um, I'm going to need one of these two cities to make... Hold on. What if you... Nope. What if you? No. Okay. Neither of them have enough room. Um, if I moved it over, actually, what if I put it here instead? One, two, three, four. Yeah, if I put it there, I'll actually be providing amenities to these three cities, which is kind of great. Why? Perfect. Wait, wait. Could it be better, though? If it was here... One, two, three, four, five, six. No, I can't ever reach our capital. Um, is it better in any way for it to be here? No. So I just put it in this empty tile. Am I missing anything? I don't believe I am. Uh, does this city eventually going to want... The city already has its own opinion. Okay. Right, now that Cole's revealed this could have been a good place for an opidium, opidum or whatever it's called. Right, the capital is going to have its own national park. Excellent point, Cameron. Excellent point, Sir Garrett Cameron. Excellent point. Okay, that's there. And after that, you know what? Just have another builder as a treat. Every tile in here upgraded. No, these could be mines. I only have nine people there. This could be a mine. Let's go up here instead. Oh, I already have a builder here. <sighs> oh, I uh, don't have plastic, so I can't do offshore oil yet. Now, give me a second. Maybe there's some other boosts I could be doing. I'm about to make a national point uh, park. I could own three privateers. Oh, these are just boats? Maybe I don't care about that. That's a lot. Uh, that's a lot to put in. Build two neighborhoods. Build two shipyards. Okay, let's get... That's a canal. That's not a neighborhood at all. Oh, wow. Yeah. Still a lot of map to grab here, eh? So, uh, this one is going to chop these three, and then we're going to put some farms in there just for some more housing. Don't fit the theory. Change the facts. Do I care about Oxford? Maybe. How much do I care about Oxford? Can't build it. Must be built adjacent to a campus. Does it have another restriction there? Oh, grassland or plains adjacent to a campus with a university. Wow. Yeah, 20% more science is great. Oh, speaking of 20% more science. Hey, remember like four turns ago when we were even? We're just, we're, we're accelerating at an uncontrollable velocity. Uh, keep looking at the Statue of Liberty there. Alright, can I help this city at all? Kind of, maybe? Once you get that plus three up in the north, it'll jump even higher. Oh yeah, right? Like, this city already has three population, chat. Are you kidding me? Look at this. Oh, isn't that absurd? Oh. It 
six. Jeez. I'm just looking at the yields and all these tiles, and I'm just like, what is happening? It's a little risky. I'm going to improve that tile just to culture bomb that one, and it might get destroyed by the volcano, but it is what it is. This, this could potentially be plus four if that's also a hill. We'll see. Oh, hello, Barbarian. Uh, I need you to die and not report where my base is because that would be very bad. What was the Eureka there? Hold on. Uh, class Struggle Eureka. Build three factories. Weird. It seemed as though, if I wasn't paying attention, it, it, fe it seemed as though I got the perk for that for chopping, not for getting a factory. Uh, actually, can I undo my turn? No, I can't. It's not multiplayer. Uh, I probably want another city up here eventually. Uh, congratulations, you're going to make us a settler. And then we're going to found that city, I don't know, like right on the coast? Where can I put districts that are interesting to me? I could put a plus three science right here. Because uh, we get plus one from the mountain, plus two from the geothermal. Which means it is at least a little bit interesting to me to put the city right here on the coast. Uh, what else do I do with my life at that point, though? Why is this... Why is this tile 8? I don't understand any of these yields. This is absurd. Oh! Hold on. Can I finally, for the first time ever, make a Golden Gate Bridge? I don't even know if I need it, but I could build it. Wow, you're right. I could. I could Golden Gate Bridge. Isn't that too close? Let's find out. Saddler view. You're right. What I meant was we're going to put the city right here. <laughs> Good talk. Golden Gate Bridge, I think, can still go there. Maybe it goes on top of this boat. Who knows? Um, I can still put the Science District there. This is, like, maybe a fine religious site. It's plus two. I don't know. Maybe this one just focuses on entertainment or something. Pew pew. All right, what else are you doing with your life here? Uh, I guess I'll buy this tile, 160. Maybe you just sleep or you go culture bomb. I don't know. Hey, what's up, Gunner? Thank you for those 50 biddies. Haven't played as Ambiorix yet, but I've noticed playing against them, they're very equitable when making peace. Turns out Gaul's fair in love and war. Oh, no. <sighs> Joe's cheering for you in the other room, Gunner. I think it's just important that you know that. Joe was like... Okay, let's go get those fish. All right, let's go. National Park. It's going to give us some era score. It's going to give us a Eureka moment. Uh, we have quite a few turns to earn 11 points for the next Golden Age. So that's excellent. And that should... Insufficient amenities. How sad are you? 
five amenities required. Okay, well, that's a problem, obviously. So I think, nope, need 10 people. All right, well, we'll get there soon enough. Build two banks, extract an artifact. Uh, don't really care. Instantly builds a factory. That's really good for us. More production is incredible for us. Why haven't we sacked Rome yet? Look, we're chill. We're chill. We're just here to have a good time and make friends. Why Why you have to be so violent, chat? Why can't you just enjoy in the love and peace that is playing as Gaul? Hey, I've satisfied their agenda of heavy industry. Excellent. Uh, the Petra is gone. That's uh, not a big loss. We've lost three tiles. Oh, how I never grabbed that salt. Gain three promotions. Yeah, this one's huge. This is a very, very big wonder. All your cities, not in your original continent, gain with a governor gain bonus production and faith and gold. What? Just like what? Oh, right. Uh, I'll get a coal power plant after that. Do I have a great engineer that we put on ice anywhere over here? No? Oh, there we go. This is something we were waiting for for a while, too. We wanted to form a core. I only understand friendship. Yeah. Uh, I believe if I make a second core, that's also a Eureka moment. Hi, Sophia and Hermitage. Don't really care about those. We're going to go for an archaeology museum here uh, just to try and clear out a couple of things that are a pain. And we have eight, eight people here. Plus three production every city with a power plant or a chancery. We're going to hold off on that. Is there another suzerainty we could burgle? What do you do when you convert a city? Nope. What do you do? All builders can now make a culture improvement. We don't really need that. What do you do? Plus 5% science and all your... Oh, yeah. Sorry, Japan. What's that? Move over. Okay, so our science should absolutely, absolutely just be running away with this game now. There's the coast. I wonder if I could grab all of this. Do I need to grab all of this? No. Can I grab all of this? Absolutely. It is arguable whether the human race have been Oh right, steam power. What's this? Basil winds appease the gods, don't care. Um we're going to pray for a Oh, can I not do that? All right. After this, we want uh two military engineers and we want an aquarium. Gunner! Another 50 biddies. Doing some research on Gaelic life and society. It turns out they practice a philosophy that can be called determined optimism based on addresses and morals shared in Gaelic culture. Historians found that the Gaul, that Gaul ways look on the bright side of life. Ha! <sighs> Bidoo. Bidoo. Boodoo. Doodoo. Gaul ways look on the bright side of life. What did I do to hurt you? What did I do to deserve this? Okay, we have salt. That's another amenity. That should... I can't believe this hasn't bumped us up yet. Your trolls put in some work. Thank you, Code Mage. I worked very hard to create this community that treats me with 
Love and respect. Look at these tiles. I think these tiles only get better after we get uh, some investment in the harbor as well. Sorry, we need to get the harbor down quick. I really don't want to lose the Statue of Liberty here. Wilhelmina. Oh, you like me now. Okay. That was actually a compliment. I thought she was going to talk smack again. Uh-oh. Mega Colossal Eruption. Okay. We lost six tile improvements. Um, most... Oh, wow. Hold on. You hit there? Oh, that's bad. All right. Let's repair a university after all of this. That's that's a yikes. That's a mega yikes. This is fine. Yeah, this is why I'm not too in a hurry oftentimes to repair or change everything here. All right, so let's go ahead and repair this. Okay. More factories. Uh, what's that? Climate change. Sorry, I can't hear you. I'm too busy building more mines. Is that queued work? Uh, we've had we've been able to queue work for a while. Um, when exactly it was added, I unfortunately couldn't tell you exactly. Wait, is there something else I could be doing here that's not just thinking really hard literally anything else a canal <laughs> to connect that lake no 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 Do it? That, the canal doesn't do anything. <laughs> it's a waste of production, you fools. Wow. That's another just incredible tile. You ever just look at a tile with like the best yield you've ever seen and just think to yourself, nice. The only wasted canal is the canal that goes unmade. Are you just trying to twist that Wayne Gretzky quote at me? Because I'll have you know, love that quote. You miss 100% of the canals you don't build, Serge. <laughs> this city has six people now. Uh, what do you think is more important first? Science or faith? You only pick one. That could be a plus five? Hold on. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Okay. New plan. New plan. This becomes a plus five holy site. That's absurd. And then we put a campus, a plus three campus up here. Or on top of these rocks. Yeah, but we can bank, we can snipe great people with faith. Like, faith is actually really important. Just because I'm not spending it every turn doesn't mean I'm not actually just absolutely crushing things with, uh, with that faith. Hey, what's up, Lena? Lena, I feel like you subbed like three days ago. Yeah, maybe just do science first. We can get rid of... Uh, how do I... Never mind. Uh, looks like I'm going to make a builder. And then I'm going to make a workshop. And then we're going to try and figure that out. Where's this dam go? Dam goes there. Nah, we won't flood. Famous last words. Open them. Not really worth it.
Yeah, you just subbed the other day, but it gave you the reason again. Weird. Look, I'm not complaining. What's that? Another another mine? What's my call trat now? 220? Yeah. I realized I wasn't really taking strong advantage of uh, the gall bonuses of just like putting mines literally everywhere. And I thought to myself, what if I just started putting mines literally everywhere? And uh, yeah, here we are. Why can't I clear this marsh? Oh, I don't own that tile. Fascinating. Yeah, what's up, Dudson? Got ourselves a bit of a later night stream right now. Uh, I lost two city states. You have tasted flight. You will walk the earth Receive tourism on silence. all improvements that prov For there you have Receive food. tourism on there all improvements that serve. provide culture. Amount of tourism generated is equivalent to the improvements cultural it's output. Hold on. Hold on. I just need people to appreciate what that means. Alright, wait a second. What did I lose? I lost... Nan Medal. Yeah, I think I'd rather keep Taruga right now. We'll get Nan Medal back later. Whoa, Nan Medal cost me 25 culture. Do I play with Barbarians on? Yep. Uh, we don't actually really care about Christ the Redeemer or Broadway. So, like, we're not looking for tourism. What comes after this? I just want to get to democracy. Uh, so this one, uh, plus two, plus three over there is kind of cool, actually. Um, and I could build it there. Even though it's in the shadow of the volcano, we have Liang, so we won't lose anything, which is kind of cool. Campus, plus two, yeah, a plus three open is not bad. I think this art museum is more important, though. Go ahead and put in veterancy. We're going to be working on a couple of uh, district buildings. Wait, military academies, seaports, and renaissance walls provide science? Never mind. Uh, let's go military research. All right. So we're at 260 science right now. That was worth plus two. Do I not have any walls? Let's just go ahead and pray for renaissance walls. Okay. Okay. That prayer gave us more science. Were the walls damaged? I can't pray there for whatever reason. Okay, that gave us more science. Like, it all it all ties back in. People earlier were saying... Suspecting I wasn't getting enough value out of my faith. To which I say, ha! Behold. Oh, I can actually improve these tiles because I have Liang there. Yeah, head on down to the Gaul. We've got mines. What? What do you mean, mines? Oh, you know those giant holes in the ground? Oh, yeah, this is also great. So because we have suzerain status of the Vatican, every time... Wait, maybe there's some other ones we could flip here. That's... Thanks, Joe, already. Yeah, I don't know if we could flip people here, but every time we activate... Every time we activate a great person... Uh, we culture bomb. We don't culture bomb. We uh, religious bomb, folks. Can we regular bomb, folks? No, we're peaceful. Yo, the Gaul 
Look, everybody who's ever read a book about the Gaul know that they are just all about that chill, right? The Gaul just like to party. You ever just think about mines, right? Hold on, look at this! Wait, did I lose? Oh, I have Liang. When you have Liang, you get plus two gold for all of your unimproved tiles. Ah. So what I did is I got more production, but okay, that's fine. Uh, does this city need housing? It has an aqueduct. No, we can just make a neighborhood soon. So let's just go ahead and think about where a neighborhood would go. Neighborhood would go up there. Okay, so I can go ahead and put this down. All right. Uh, needs amenities. Oh, the Catholics are coming. Um, that's fine? No, it's not fine. I need you. I actually need you here. I think I've repaired everything now. No, I need to repair that. Oh, culture bomb is so cool. I don't even know if it's good. It's just fun, right? Fez has negotiated peace. My alliance has expired with Basil. Hey, what's up? Buddies? Yeah. Alliance time. Oh, wait. Uh, let's trade for more diamonds. Wait, what do you mean? Sure. Make a deal. Oh, look who's got incense. I have to spend a little extra here. That's fine. You want to be buds? Hey, there we go. Wait a second. Plus three new reports. Can I see those? Yeah, this is one of the new... So I'm playing the Gaul. They were added new. And uh, they were added on Thursday. And if you haven't seen Basil before, this is one of the other new leaders that came out on the Thursday update as part of the pass. They're pretty cool. They focus on religious war. Catherine, the Owls of Minerva, okay, all right. Seems like a lot of folk have more money than I do, that's fine. We'll get there. Nice crossbow. Yeah, you're a little unhappy up here, aren't you? Uh, do I have enough money to purchase this tile yet? No. How can I go about getting that tile with no money? <laughs> Basil brush off just in chat. <gasps> no relations. You sure? You can't trace your roots back to Byzantium? Hold on, time out. What did I do to you? Denounces me. Evil cannot stay hidden for long. Evil? It's a pretty big value judgment there. You're a vampire. Calling the kettle black there. Evil. Disappointed that I don't earn much faith? What? Okay, she's making 350 a turn. I'm making 160 a turn. But in my opinion, you're evil. Uh, I've just gained an additional trade route. Can I pray for traders? No. Uh, what do you got going on after this? You're pretty busy. Right, you're literally doing nothing. Get us a trader, please. Oh! 
Oh, now that we have oil, we have a plus four construction. That was not great English. A plus four construction district up there. Uh, I could also put a an aquatic entertainment district right here, which is kind of goofy. I might put it here instead. Or if I put it here, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'm going to put it there after. Let's lock in that price. Let's throw that into the garbage. And then after that, uh, plus five neighborhood out here. Let's lock that price in. Lake gang. Not enough Kevinism? Wrong stream. Over here. We just speak of the good word of Joe. Uh, plus two, plus four. Campus? Plus two, plus three in the shadow of a volcano. Seems a little risky. Uh, neighborhood. Right. Let's go ahead and give ourselves a... Ooh, no. We don't want our people to die. Let's go ahead and put a plus four up here. Last! Thank you for that prime in 18 months. Appreciate it. Okay, get ourselves a bank. I beheld the wretch. All right, so that'll give him thanks, Joe. Right, of course. Is this a hill? Hey, what's up, Elder Thurman? Yeah, it's a rare evening stream. Thank you, everyone who's been stopping by and chilling out. All right, so uh, we've had science stolen from our capital. We have a spy there now. You know what we should do? Uh, let's go pick on you, and let's start stealing some money. What's the best thing I could do right now? Gain some sources. Let's try and level up this spy. Give me money for no reason. Oh, no. I'm just going to ignore you instead. All right. We're running away. 306 science, 230 culture, and the discovery of aluminum. Let's go get us that aluminum. So one, two, three, four. Ah, it's unfortunately under a farm tile. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Because that means getting rid of that tile is also going to change the whole shape. But the fact that we have access to a bunch of aluminum is great. The Anth... Wait, how do I pronounce this? The Anthinity? Thank you for 100 biddies. Today has been a treat. Surge got to eat pizza. Now we get late night Surge and some money theft. You know, just a... We can have a little bit of theft as a treat. Right, chat? Build a cold mile and an ironclad. Well, I never did that, but I guess I got that for free. Uh, chemistry, have a level two. Ooh. Do you like me some science labs? Okay. Now that that is done. Um, 250? Okay. Hold on. How do I... Once again, I find myself unable of getting... Unable to get the tiles that I really desperately want. It's not theft if you don't get caught. That's not how that works. But I appreciate your energy. <laughs> hold on, hold on, time out. What, what is it then? If you steal and you don't get caught, what have you done? I'm very curious. Uh, okay. 
Not too worried about it. Uh, we've lost Nan Medal again. There's definitely a point where it becomes very, very difficult to hold on to too many cities. Uh, train a bomber. Okay. Oh, right. Uh, this... Hold on. Hold on. Am I going to get the Golden Age here? Eight turns. I have to connect two cities via railroad. Uh, bomber's going to cost me seven turns. Okay. That'll be ready in time. It's still theft. Born without the intent to return. Capitalism. Ooh, galaxy brain. This intelligence brought us back from the... It's still theft. All right. I don't know what I don't know what kind of answer I was expecting. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go ahead and rip up, rip this up, and get that aluminum. I thought I had another settler nearby. Where did they? Oh, they're right there. Excellent. I was like, where did they go? It's the liberation of money. Oh. Oh, it's unprosecuted theft. I mean, you can get caught and still not be prosecuted. Let's be real. Uh, all right. So I'm making... I think if I get myself a an aerodrome... I think an aerodrome is also going to be worth a ton of points. I'm just going to go ahead and put it here. So I think the zoo will get me some points. I think if I made another musketman instead of this neighborhood and I make a second army, I think that's a point. Let me just check something here really quickly. Air tracker, civilization, master spy. No. First railway between two cities. That's what we're going to do. Oh, first mountain tunnel is another one. So I should be able to get that pretty quick. Uh, I don't know. I'll put it there somewhere stupid. So that's two, four. World's first flight. I think we can get that. World's first satellite. No. Okay, that one's already gone. First mountain tunnel. Yeah. World's first neighborhood. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Time out. Go back. Turns out I was actually en route for one there. World's first armada, world's first army. Oh, probably didn't get the world first there. Did I forget the city itself or the world? I think we're fine. I think as long as we go down and connect them, you don't need to worry about that. It is for movement, but for the purposes of connecting, I think I just have to do one, two, three, and I'm good. What's up, Skyotonic? Good to see you. Have we made a seafaring unit? Yeah, we made a caravel. The issue is... Um, we don't really need any anywhere. What is this unit available for promotion? Uh, let's just kill this swords thing first. We'll promote afterwards. What a great ability. Except I needed to spread to this side of the mountain. You know what? I'm just going to buy that tile. Thinking for error score, yeah. I haven't done a great job of tracking it, but so it goes. Alliance level has increased. Amazing. Okay. Seven points, seven turns. We can do this.
What other ones do we have here? World's for first shipwreck excavated. Okay, so we're going to get that done shortly. Uh, give me a second. Let's check our great people here. Religious artifacts. Religious artifacts are always interesting. I don't know how much I care, though. Uh, looks like we're going to get that one anyways. Great engineer. Not really at any risk there. I don't care about this great scientist. We could push circumnavigate. Oh, interesting. You are 100% correct. Let's just start. I don't know if we'll get that now. Play a lot of Civ at your house? Nice. Nice. Hiya Sophia's gone. That's fine. Yeah, I mean, Wilhelmina, please. I literally just got denounced for not trading. Um, first of all, rude. Second of all, how dare you? Wonder completed. There's a fire. So... Where do I want that campus to be? I wanted that campus to be... Oh, it could be either one of those. Great. So if I go here and I make a mine, then we can lock in the price for the next district. Wait, hold on. Yeah, eight population already. It's so... Plus Plus five? Okay, never mind. Uh, I was going to ignore it for a bit. I can't pass up plus five bonus there. And we have Liang, so we don't have to worry about that. We're going to lose a bit of a monster tile. Is that the best tile the city's working? Uh, we're going to lose the food and the science. But the plus five is going to get turned into plus five from this anyways. With a bigger upside. So all the production we're losing, we're actually going to replace. Let's just go ahead and do that. Need more aerodromes. Oh, right. So, next turn we'll get the railroad done. You... How do I... Do I not have... Wait, do I not have the technology to tunnel through a mountain yet? Foolish! Oh, I can't actually get there. Okay, so I was counting on that as part of my era score, and it turns out I uh, I miscounted. All right, so let's go ahead and pray for everything here. Uh, wait, can you actually not build anything? No suitable location. Um, why is that? Okay, I guess I'm starting with an aqueduct. Sure, why not? I see the mark of evil. Okay. I mean, you're the one wearing the mask, but, like, let's not... Let's not judge. Industrial era ends. Okay, plus two. We got our first... To rally people. Yeah, good. Hold on. What if I don't want to get rid of either of these tiles? I guess I can get rid of the crabs. You know what? We're going to get rid of the crabs. Uh, no, I really, really want to build there. But I really, really also need the Statue of Liberty. Ah, but then I lose the crabs. Swap tile ownership? Q. 
Okay, what what are you working? I need you to have this tile. All right, I need you to work that. I need you to work this and this. And then that's worth five. That's worth five. Okay, so production's lower, but you're going to grow faster. So you should grow in 13 turns is a very long time. It looks like I'm wearing a shark on my head. The new city might want to borrow some tiles. No, I really want to get... Um... Okay, I just need to save up 255 is what I need to do. Or, actually, Galaxy Brain. We're going to buy that tile. And then I'm going to build a mine on it and grab those three. Okay, five turns, seven more points. I got the neighborhood done. Observation balloon, does that count as the first flight? No. Got the cannon coming. Oh, why I can't build stuff there? Yeah, it's fine. Again, we want to move up here in this direction. I'm not too worried about this city. Sometimes you just grab a city just to fill the space, right? Yo! Max, what up, my friend? Were you doing some fiddling today? Thank you so much for bringing the community by. What's up? Twitch.tv slash Sharkfists. Actually, one of the moderators on this channel. Good friend of mine. And a musician who's been rocking some fiddling lately. How'd your stream go? Shark attack. Yeah, no kidding. Hey, friend. Can construct the fisheries improvement. That's exciting. Wait, no. We don't care. Oh, <laughs> I didn't actually have the reinforcements done. That's awkward. Def doing some fiddling. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, bud. Hope you're doing well. Still having a great time checking out the Gaul right now. I have a neighborhood. Yeah, let's make this second musket man. Let's see if I can't get a second army. Really enjoying playing for people? That's awesome. That's awesome. Nanmadal wants a cavalry. Oh, Nanmadal wants a cavalry. Wait, 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 wait. I forgot I can just pray for military units. Nope, I'm out of faith. Wait, am I out of faith? Ah, I discovered the problem. Suffix, thank you so much for 29 months of support. All right, so uh, somebody was asking about, do I need to build a railroad in the city to connect them? One, two, three. Nope. You just have to connect the tiles in between, which is weird though, because if I wanted to go from here to this city, I would absolutely need to have the railroad inside. You actually slow down to normal road speed if you don't have that. It's kind of frustrating. All right, can I reach? There's a city that wants to trade with me called Rome. No. Where are you? You're there. You know what? I bet you if I just walked there, I could trade with them. So what I want to do is I want to move you up to here and then just chill. Ah, good. We're here. Okay. Uh, let's gain some sources, and then we're going to try and steal some money. Ah, 
Oh, you took the Colosseum from me. Oh! Well, that's awkward. Hello? My improvements! My boats! They've all been smashed. Uh, let's go ahead and start repairing that Ferris wheel. Kind of an awkward day to be at the water park. Let's just put you to sleep for a couple seconds here. Thought having two armies gave you some other points there, but that's obviously a lie. Shindan with that diamond bean chat. If I get some hearts, love to see it. Machine to run smoothly and predictably, its parts must be standard and hence upgrade farm improvement to mechanize agriculture. Bonus food adjacency for every farm. Pasture improvements get a bonus to production. We are popping off. The city could use a little bit of love. And I'm kind of mega poor this game. Military research. Anything for gold? Not really. Oh, I could probably give Republic Works. Okay, next time, three turns, we're going to change our policies out a bit here. Four turns. Okay. Requires oil for my first plane. Oh, that's too bad. Meladia! What's up, friend? Brand new Twitch Prime. How are you? Thank you for the support. Chemistry. Right. So I can't actually collect oil yet because I don't have access to plastic. Raincoast Bear. Brand new Twitch Prime. What's up? What's up? Spreading that prime love around. I appreciate that. Thank you. I wonder if there's things that I could be selling to people to make some money here. Wait, am I short a an additional... Um, Trader as well? No, they just they're just waiting on their turn, right? Alright, let's start talking to our allies here. Yo, how you doing? Uh talk to me about this gunpowder. Sure. I just need to start making some money, so I'm going to start selling things. You purchased a Hario Immersion Switch and Bueno Kettle Fighter because of your teachings? Yo! Heck yeah, friend! Are you stoked? Are you the happiest person? All right, Suleiman's giving us some good money here. We're just going to keep trading with our allies. Wow. Whoa, what the? You can hold more strategic resources if you have more encampments, right? That's why they can hold 200 or whatever there. One-time deal of 120. Amazing. That one-time deal is actually pretty real because that gives me enough money to do this now. And then where's that nearest builder? I need you to get going right there. 
All right, let's go down to our capital now. Are you about to get killed by the storm? Because that'd be real unfortunate. Okay, that's been improved. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Three turns, three points. Trading post created. Wait, hold on. If I capture this encampment, I think you get error score every time you do that. Big Ben. Extra policy card. Seems good to me. Really want to make sure nobody snipes this from us. Do you get error score every time you get a great person chat? National Park founded. We got that. Great person lured by gold. What about great person lured by faith? Sniping it? It says it looks like that, but... Enemy city adopts a religion. Holy rival city captured. So, all right. I really want... I really want another golden age. Okay, that was worth plus one. Okay. Two turns. Two turns. Two turns. Two turns. All right, repeatable. How much do you get for taking a barbarian encampment? Is it one or two? Canal completed? Are you kidding me? Uh, first mountain tunnel. Can't do that. First tier three government. Can't get that. Landed on the moon. No. All governors appointed. Okay. First armies. Done. First large city is... Uh, I don't know if it's 15. No. First unit with promotion of distinctions. No. Uh... We haven't done oil. We have done coal. We have done horses. We have done coal, right? Haven't we? Maybe I don't have an ironclad yet. Can I pray for an ironclad? No, we have a bomber coming out next turn. And that takes niter, which we already have. Shoot. Continue to click on the wrong button here. All right, maybe you're regretting not having made that canal. If we had any oil, we could launch an inquisition. I don't have. Wait, does that give you error score? First inquisition, really? Where was that? Inquisition begins is worth one point. Yeah, we don't have our first fleet either. All right. Who wants to see pictures of the stake? If you're in the Discord, passerby, throw them in there. All right, let's get an Inquisitor. Wait. Wait, who launches an Inquisition? Who do I have to pray for here? Is it an apostle or I thought you needed an, how do you make it? Sorry. I guess I don't know how to make an inquisition happen, do I? Starts an inquisition requires one apostle charge. All religious units get plus 15 strength. Minus 25% science in all cities. That's not worth. That is not worth. That is super not worth. Um, passerby, as long as you join the Discord, you're in forever. We don't uh, we don't remove people if their subs lapse.
All right, we're going to move this person here. Just try and get a new... Wait, was that the dark card policy? Hold on. Start Inquisition with one Apostle charge. No. I think they also have a card here, though. Technically, that... Mm. Do you need to have the policy card to even use the possibility to do that? Inquisitor, okay. Requires a temple. I definitely have a temple here. Why can't I have an Inquisitor then? The policy makes it only cost one charge. What am I missing? The city has a holy site. This holy site has a temple. Allows the purchase of Inquisitors. But. As soon as I go to pray. Yeah, I mean, I, I know you can't build it, but I don't have the option. I have a missionary apostle guru. And nowhere else on this list do I have Inquisitor. And I don't know why that is. That's very odd to me. You have to create an Apostle first, start an Inquisition, and then make Inquisitors? We're going through some hoops here. All right, we'll try it out. I, I want that. I want that golden age chat. All right, this is our last turn. Oh, I don't. I don't. I can't get there. Oxford University is gone. I think that's a little bit unfortunate. Okay, what happened here? Oh! Alright, we're one point shy. We have begun our Inquisition. City-state reward. Okay. No. Come on. Not like this game. Not like this. Oh, right. Right here. Right here. Hold on. No, 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 no. I just... But... We captured a barbarian camp. And that's repeatable, right? A King in Green, thank you very much for gifting a sub over to Passerby there. While I sit here, devastated by the fact that I'm going to be one point off. After a certain era, it's going to stop giving out points. Oh, no. Oh, no. How does gift subbing work? Do I have to pick someone or let it be random? You can do two ways, the passerby. One, you can click on a person in chat. You'll see the option to gift a sub under their name. Or number two, up at the top right, there's just a random button that says gift a sub and it'll select somebody at random. It's a weighted random. So it goes, what's up, Seed? Welcome. 
I am currently sad. And I don't know how to fix it. I am just filled with sadness and I don't know how to fix it. How do I fix this? How do I fix being off by one chat? Uh oh, that's really bad. Oh, that's also really bad. Why is my builder there? Oh no. Well, that's a little awkward. Wait, I have an artist? I somehow have Titian? Art? Ah. <sighs> One point off from a golden age. There's got to be. There's got to be something. There's got to be something we can do. Alright. Is there anyone I can buy with gold? Can I somehow get 1,700 gold this turn? That's impossible. Oh, yeah, I'm checking the great person scores right now. And I can't get faith. But maybe I can get money. Alright. Let's see if we can cheese. How much money do you have? You'll give me one one gold? Uh, 60. What if this was 50? Would you do that? What if this was 60? Would you do that? Okay, 50. All right. All right, we got to get a little bit of the old fromage here, chat. <laughs> all right, so I can do this. Wait, I should see if someone else will offer me a better price before I sell it all there. Make a deal. You got money. Uh, that's 210. Wait a second. Would you give me... Would you give me 150? Would you give me 120? Would you give me 130? Would you give me... I got 130. Do I hear 140? Oh, I can sell my diplomatic favor for cash, too. Okay, hold on. I can do this a bunch of times. Up to 140. Okay. You know what? I'm just going to do this. 140 is a pretty good price. Okay. I just need to get up to 13 hundo. Oh, we have so far to go. Oh, you're out. Now you're out. One forty. One thirty, one twenty. If it's gonna be one hundred, I'm gonna be a little bit disappointed. One ten. Oh man! All right. Yeah, just selling diplomatic favor seems like it may have been the way to go there. Okay. Well, this is gonna take a bit, but. We're going to we're going to drain the pockets of all of our allies right now. <laughs> wow, they will they will just buy everything. All 
All right, what am I at right now? A thousand. We're getting there. We're getting there. Passerby, thank you very much for gifting a random sub to the community. And congratulations to IVN21. Oh, my love. Thank you very much. Joe just brought me pie. All right. Well, you know what? I don't care about you. Japan is going to buy my stuff, right? Right, Japan? Right? Uh, a little bit more. I think, I think 1400 and I'll be clear. Okay, there we go. There we go. So, back to the great person menu. Uh, who was $1,300 do? The cheapest was 17? <sighs> hey, what's up, Japan? <laughs> what's, what's that? I need more money. All right, I need one other person to buy stuff off me. Suleiman, what's up? I know you only have $100, but what if you gave it all to me? Oh my God, yes. Okay, all right. I forgot that there are other numbers that came after 17. <sighs> I laugh so I don't cry. <laughs> hey, what's up, Rome? How you doing? How you doing, bud? Do you just not care about diplomacy? You know what? You get a deal. Just because I like... Hey, what's up, Cameron? I am doing just the scummiest stuff right now. I'm one point away from a golden era, the turn before, and I just went through and nickel and dimed all of my allies for era score so that I could buy a great person I'm already going to win just so I can guarantee this golden age. There we did. We did it. We did it. All right. Uh, you instantly build a factory in a place, right? So let's stop. Let's ignore that. Wait. Do you build a workshop and a factory? What do you what do you do? Gaul is interesting. Gaul is hard. Gaul is harder than I thought they were going to be. The um where and how you build cities is just so different. Yeah. Shay Leons, thank you so much for 10 months. Appreciate you, friend. Yeah. Bold take on what if... Yeah, No civilization has ever really been able to take advantage of production. <laughs> I'm uh, just the, the courage to make a sieve that has good production, right? Yeah, like look at this weirdo sieve. In order to make a, um, like, districts that take advantage of this, normally I'd want my city right by the, gar the Great Barrier Reef, but my districts are going to end up being, like, here, here, and here. And I put my city right up against the mountain. It's really bizarre. What are you, what are you doing with your life? Apart from the sanitation, the medicine, education, wine, public order, roads, the fresh water oh, system, and we desperately health. need this wonder. This what wonder is very, very, very important for us because we're going for a diplomatic victory here. Uh, additional trade route. All right. Bonus production towards wonders. 
campus science adjacency bonus also yields production? Uh, yes, please. Well, that's that's a slam dunk right there. Governor title. We actually want to max out a governor here. And I think that governor is going to be... Reyna, because we need gold. We need power. We lost Nanmadal. Do we have Nanmadal back? Wow, who am I fighting with here? A couple of people. Train of Cavalry. Okay, religious conversion. That's a little bit awkward. Religious conversion. That's a little bit awkward. Inspiration for professional sport. Build four entertainment complexes. Uh, yikes. Okay, cavalry is about to get done there. Send a trade route to Valletta. Okay. Advanced ballistics. Have two oil power plants. Oh, that's also kind of tricksy. Uh, well, let's just pray the poop away. Okay, we got a sewer now. Good. So, it looks like we might be getting pretty close to circumnavigating the globe here. Build a factory and a workshop. And then all factories, all factories now produce plus two production. That's absurd. That's so good. Okay, um, and next thing we're going to do is teleport you up north. Uh, speaking of which... Oh yeah, we can pray for civil infrastructure, and so I then just prayed for sewers, and uh, yeah, we just got to pray the poop away there. I need that to die before it gets back. And I need to not lose my builder. Yeah, it's a perfectly normal sentence. What's the problem? <laughs> In fact, I wish Victoria City Council had just adopted that problem years ago. Ban the production of this type of building. Or, what if? Oh! What if we just made oil cheaper to burn? And I can just bully everybody here. Oh, wait. Uh, Ambiorix, let's go ahead and give myself 11 votes here. World Fair, I'm going to win that regardless. Yeah, it's just based on great people points generated. That should be a free one there. Um, they're probably going to guess coal. So rather than bully people, let's just actually vote along with coal. And let's go ahead and put me in a bubble. They've never even heard of nuclear power. How are they banning it? I'm sorry, what? Like, these people haven't even discovered uranium, but they've heard of a theoretical... some kind of supposed thing that brings them fear. Don't like that. Don't like that one bit. All right, I need to get that wonder kind of desperately. And that was called the U. Must be built on a river. Yeah, the Anti-Nuclear Proliferation Treaty of 1515. We don't understand it, therefore we fear it.
perfectly normal human reaction. Okay, um, I don't want to lose production there. So what if I didn't? Where else could I build this? It has to be adjacent to a river. It's tremendously important to the development of my... Sus uh, no, okay, never mind. Yeah, it's just going here. Uh, I will be losing... Honestly, not that much production. We're producing 60 here. Yeah, bonus diplomatic favor for every turn that we're a suzerain of a city-state is mega huge. Uh, bonus food if powered. Or. Or. Hmm, there might be no ore. Let's just get you a supermarket. So, the other place that was working on a factory shoot, where was it? Coal plant. Oh, it was up here. Wait, can I not? Oh, can you only do that on your continent? Interesting, I didn't realize there was a restriction. Right, I have a cavalry. Uh, this cavalry is going to be used to scout the world. You can purchase units with faith, hardly. World Cong Congress has awarded me four diplomatic points. How are we doing for our uh, diplomacy win here? We're at 10 of 20. Okay. Uh, I can get suzerain status back again. Don't mind if I do. We're crushing science. We're second for culture behind Japan. What kind of bonuses does Japan get for culture? Like, how are they, how are they doing so well here? Gonna chop, try and get that uh, wonder better. Trying to get vision on uh, that city over there. That's awkward. Never want to jump in the water and immediately find barbarians. All other lands found on the western side of the boundary shall belong to the king and queen of Castile and their successors. Chemists do not usually stutter. Oh, right. Plus three governor promotions. Nice. And bonus great merchant points. Feeling pretty good about that. So let's go ahead and max out Reyna here. It's going to give us some error score for our first ever maxed out person there. These are really hard to track. Advanced flight, no. I want plastic. 
Plastic is going to be big here. And then after that, we'll find out. Let's learn about this uranium that the world um, fears. Gotta be honest, a lot of these Catholics are making me a little nervous right here. Look, we're just chilling here. We're having a good time talking about perfectly ordinary religion of thanks, Joe. And uh, I'd appreciate it if they cool it a bit, right? Oh, I understand. Crap. I couldn't teleport into the city because, of course, couldn't teleport into the city because I had another great person in the city already. So where's my, where did you go? Have I already moved you? Did I put you in the sea somewhere? Where did my great engineer go? Uh, James is in the sea. Okay, that's... You know what? That's fine. You seem happy down there. We got computers. We can purchase units with faith. We require additional amenities. Ah, <laughs> oh, Cam. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, um, what else, what else can you do for me? What else can this city do? I mean, I guess just keep, just keep on keeping on there, new city. Something I've, um come to accept as I put more hours into civilization is sometimes your cities can just suck. What? Uh, you know what? Maybe, maybe we just ignore that. Wait, I had another promotion available? Wait. Wait. Sources gained. Excellent. Awesome. Now, now's your chance. We can steal $1,400 from Wilhelmina? Uh, just in case it fails, let's just make sure all of our allies are ready here. Hey, what's up? Yeah, we good? We cool? We bros? Enter into a research alliance here. Awesome. All right. Good. I've been in alliance with these other nations for the better part of hundreds of years. Trust is implicit. I just have to make sure. Don't mess with me. Don't west. Don't mess with me, Wilhelmina. I assure you, it's going to go poorly. Research lab. Our science. Yo, what's up, Lair of Lore? What's up, Raiders? Chat. If I could get some hearts. If I get some positivity. Welcoming these friends stopping on by. What were you up to? What were you streaming? Not sure what this barbarian is doing, but you know what? If they don't mess with me, I won't mess with them. Uh... Some Among Us! Oh, very nice. There was also a brief TQ. Nice. I like the sentence. We're doing Among Us with friends and TQ. You're like, ah. Uh. <laughs> okay. I need... It's a coal power plant. Uh, I need more trade routes after this, apparently. Apparently not. Hey, Floofy. Thank you very much for gifting a sub over there to Dreamy Pants. Nope. Apparently I'm... Do I just have traders that are just asleep somewhere? Like, what are you... Oh, I do. 
Oh. How many trade routes do I have that are just asleep? Oh. That was just money we're leaving on the table. You did it just to see what the alert looked like and where I placed it? <laughs> Are you wondering about how to make like a um, um, a scene alert and questions like that, Floofy? I try and be pretty transparent on all those sorts of questions. The best steel doesn't always shine the brightest. All right, quick timeout, quick aside. You're going to see infinite everything for just a second. But, here, I'll put it up in the top corner. Hopefully, that's not too mega infinite. So, I have alerts broken down into a couple different types. I have a follow alert up in the top left corner. You can see it right there. So, when a follow comes in, there's no big noise. It just shows up. It's a little, like, wave, and it goes away. I have subs and raids appear in the very center of the screen here. Um, and then for bits and donos, I have them up in the top right corner just for a little bit more variation. You can get away with having a single alert just dead center and get away with everything fine. If we go to the booth, hi. Wait, shoot. If it's the booth, you can't see. I can't show you the booth. All right. Good talk. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Can you see both sides now? Can you see both sides? Yes. Okay. So if I hit booth, can you now see both sides? You can see all the sides. I don't have a Kofi link in my other thing. That's interesting. Okay. So once again, I have um, alerts in the top left corner there, and then I have everything else grouped up into one big alert, which goes here so it doesn't obscure the stream. So it depends on the scene we make. It uh, uh, is how I is how I set everything up. Yeah. All right. There you go. There's a, a very quick behind the scenes on how bleh, how I set up my Twitch or how I set up my OBS. Part of me. More railroads. Okay, we've now connected our capital. This is something I just like doing. I don't... I don't know if it's good. Wait, am I trapped? No, I want to get to the city. Oh, are you trying to kill the city? I can't help but notice it doesn't have any walls. And there's a bunch of military units walking forward. Oh, what? Uh, what have we found here? The city-state of Venice. Which had previously been undiscovered for the entirety of the playthrough? Are you kidding me? Nobody... Uh, whenever you discover a city-state, if you're the first person to find it, you get a free envoy in it. No one had ever discovered Venice up until now. That's absurd. Armored Assault Possum, thank you so much for that Prime and Resub. Welcome back. Ooh, the Galapagos. Ooh, sciency. Like, something else that surprises me, check this out. When we talk to Basil, Basil has literally only ever met Japan and Poland. That's it. No system. That's it. They haven't met anyone else this entire game, which is absurd. All right, let's get rid of public works. Uh, now what we want is adjacency bonus for campus and industrial zone. That's going to be incredible for us. That's going to be very powerful. And then we want to have... 
Uh, we want Envoy Generation. Where is that? Do we not get that anymore? Oh, there we go. Open Borders and Bonus Envoy Generation. Very, very strong. And then finally, am I still worried about Great Science Points? Maybe not. Theater score adjacency bonus. Nope. Holy site adjacency bonus. More faith is always good. I don't mind faith. It'll help us fight for uh, great people better. I've never gone for a... I've never gone for a um, diplomacy win before, so I'm having an interesting time trying to figure out how to prioritize for this. I guess I can just do production towards wonders. Skyscrapers here. Right on, Dreamy. Right on. Get these religious buildings done. Then get a coal power plant going. We're going to tunnel right through that hill. Aha! Aha! This is wild. There's the Bermuda Triangles right there, too. Give me money for literally no reason. No thank you. Like, how? How? How did Byzantium never go down here? Also, how are they producing 259 science with... Oh, they have way more cities than I thought they did. Okay, well, they've... Sorry, where are they? They must go up. They must be all the way up in here. They just never went down. Uh, Suleiman, we need to renew our alliance here. Buddy? Yeah, what's up? Make a deal. Wait. Make an alliance deal. Level 2. I can't actually remember what level 2 does. You gain 20% of your allies' tourism? Whoa, what? Uh, Eiffel Tower seems good. Bonus appeal. I kind of... Oh, well, good... Ah, uh, no. That's like all of the food for my city here. Oh, uh, let's just get another spy. Check the city-states. What do we got? Trade route. Eureka for ballistics. Right. Correct. Eureka for ballistics. Oil power plants. We're not actually collecting oil yet, so we can't do that. Inspiration for professional sports. How many entertainment districts do I have? Currently, I have two. I would need four... I don't know if I care that much. I could just be a suzerain here. You know what? Like, oh no, I don't have any points right now. I take that back. Also, I don't know if they're broken or what's happening, but they've been running around. At least the Catholics have just been like looking at things, but never actually, never actually settling on converting anything yet. Okay, so now that we've found Kaguna, I should be able to trade with it. I was gifted a builder? Fantastic. Alright, this is also going to give us a point here. Some error score. Love it. Uh, what else can we chop? I guess we're going to go chop down this rainforest. Sorry, Big Ben. Big Ben needs you. Uh, 
All right, now they're happy that I gossip because we're trading with people. We got open borders. We're in alliances. Suleiman likes us. Do you really need to cut down the rainforest for Big Ben? Yep. Yeah, sorry. No other way around it. Where are those entertainment districts? There's one literally right there, and I'm still not happy. All right, so let's, uh, let's go trade with some friends here. How will into the bed look? I don't know. I guess maybe we feed our workers with it. I don't ask any questions. The game tells me I chop, I get big men faster. That's good enough for me. All right, trade an orange for an elephant. Love it. Good laugh. Good joke. Good joke, Trajan. What? All right, Japan. hold on. Let's try this again. Oh, right, you already have elephant. You'll take it anyways. You know what? Sure. So the goal here is to trade uh, luxury resources that we have to other people to try and get our happiness up. What? You'll just let me buy it for money? Oh my goodness. You're also unhappy, and I don't appreciate that for a second. Uh, I could replace this cow. I could replace this cow with the Eiffel Tower. Interesting. Yeah, you know what? Why not? Oh, we got... More sewers means more suffrage. Interesting. Uh, got two envoys to place. What the? What is happening here? My city-state menu appears to be a little bit borked right now. Or does it just always look like that? All right, did I lose suzerainty of any of these cities? I think I'm fine, actually. Okay, let's just chill for a second. What are you making? Oh, you're making the Eiffel Tower. Shoot. You're also the only person who could get me... Um, a... Archaeologist? Did I make that up? Hmm. We here at the Historical Cow Preservation Society feel like we must lodge a complaint. Look. Complaints closed a week ago. It's really quite unfortunate. Uh, we had hoped that with all the notices that we had posted, you would have an opportunity there. But you missed it. Minor defeat. Let's just go ahead and heal there. All right, give ourselves a nice little triangle there. It's good stuff. Uh, um, well, time out. Why is a woman to be treated hey, we're at war chat. Well, that's exciting. That's exciting. Who pulled me into war and with whom? With whomst? Why Why must we fight? Let's grab Merchant Republic. Get ourselves some more dollar dues right now. 
And I guess that's worth 20 gold per turn if I take that. Bo double our holy site adjacency bonus. Oh, that's great. That actually gets us more production as well. All right. Now war has been declared. Hey, there we go. First humans to circumnavigate the globe. That's some good era score. Why am I at war? Did I just discover another city-state? Oh, I'm at war with them, too. Your builders can now make monasteries. Monasteries provide faith. 15 healing for friendly religious units that have not attacked this turn. Huh. <clears throat> you pave over one cow and suddenly you're at war. All right, where are you? So you're simultaneously at war with uh, Japan as well as... Okay, that seems like a bad idea. <clears throat> that is up and to the left of me, eh? Do we share any meaningful border? No. Did I finish a great wonder that someone else is building? I can't remember. Look, I finish a lot of wonders. I can't be expected to keep track of them all. Uh, plus four great work slots. Eh. War department. Eh. Royal Society. Builders gain the ability to use all their charges to provide bonus production to a district once per turn. I'm not going for space race. I don't know if I really care about the war department either. I think I just go for the Natural History Museum here. But first, zoo. Pray for a sewer. Are they the Catholics? They are. Ah, I see where I see what you're saying. Uh, uh, um, wait, I can plant another forest and then just chop it down again. Fascinating. Do I have to worry about anything? I don't know if I do. Okay, let's go ahead and give ourselves this plus three science area here. Lock it in. It's probably more important. Than, uh, actually, the aqueduct running out of population here. Do I want another city up here? There's a volcano. That's always exciting. Do I want to go to war? You know what? Probably not. Stopping by to say hi before you watch the community tour. Nice. Thanks for stopping by, friend. Have a good one. Oh. Just the mountains there. Oh, well, yeah, this is going to go really poorly for you. Like, look at this wall. Just the wall of encampments. Wow. What is this? Why do you get plus? Hold on. Why does Byzantium get plus three culture on a mine? Oh, that's amber. Plains Hill Amber. What? Fascinating. Whatever, we're just going to keep scouting things out here, right? Okay, there's our Golden Gate Bridge. All tiles in the city get plus four appeal, 100% tourism from improvements and national parks in the city. Trade routes can multiply the gold? Wow. Grants the city plus four amenities. Okay, so once that's done, once we get the science district done, yeah, it'll be time for the Golden Gate Bridge chat.
which is a wonder. I don't know if I've... Have I ever completed it on stream? Is it just a dream? Let's try and work hard for some great engineer points. District building provides plus two production. Yeah, this is huge. Will my allies get mad? No, this isn't like other games. Like, um, I tried a little bit of Crusader Kings. Did, did not quite fit my brain. And that was a game where your allies will just be like, wow, you suck. We went to war and we were counting on you. You're like, oh, I... Awkward. I kind of just said yes to give you face, but I didn't actually really care. Okay, I need a promotion here. Oh, I'm going to die. Oh, I read that wrong. I thought I was winning that fight. Well, goodbye. F. Goodbye, Pike and Shot. You were too pure for this world. Oh, yo! Jawiga's actually kind of a, like, a military powerhouse here. Look at this. I mean, I'm still going to kill our unit. Wait, no, I'm not? That was odd. Did I ever try Age of Empires? Yeah. I played, I played some old school Age of Empires. I put my reps in on that game. AoE 2? Good times. I didn't play like the remaster when it came back out, but uh, loved that game growing up. So I'm a little bit concerned about stuff. I'm going to try and save up for a field cannon on, uh, on these coastal cities here. Uh, oh no! Who? Whomst? You were not able to complete it. Who got there? Catherine. I don't know how close I was. I wonder if I was supposed to chop there. We did just steal a ton of money though. So let's look at this promotion here. Quartermaster is very strong. Let's buy the shipyard just for the boost of production. Yeah, it shaves a turn. I realize I'm probably supposed to be saving this money for other better things. But... It makes me happy. Hey, what's up, Defay? Oh, I needed that wonder. That stings. Okay, let's go there and then... not the biggest deal. Wait, harbor? There's a coast here? Have you ever just turtled up and continuously nuked the passages to your base because the AI would just walk into it and, and sieve? I very rarely, if ever, use nukes and sieve. Uh, let's go... Uh, let's go mess with the Netherlands some more. Seems like a great idea. Can't see any possible downside to this. Okay, plastic in three turns. Let's set ourselves up to have builders ready for that. Oh, look. That person has a, a rock at, at the end of a rope. The utter melon. Okay. 
No! Again? No! Big Ben was just sniped from me. What? What is happening? Oh, man. All right. Well, let's put down a district for a turn, I guess. Well, that's upsetting. Yeah, I'm... Yeah. <laughs> What's going on? We're getting sniped. Snipers are taking those shots. Okay, we want to keep our eye out for this apostle. Make sure they can't get away. Uh, what's that? Steal a thousand gold. Don't mind if I do. This upgrade brought to you by the Dutch. Lost suzerain status the of Nan Medal. Has changed everything except Don't like that. K C O Y G W. Uh, I don't know if there's a word in there. Thank you so much for four months. Woot woot the Dutch. They cry. <clears throat> Who? Basil, bad. Wait, do I care more about Auckland? No, <clears throat> no, I don't. Uh, got a great writer and a great musician. You know what? I mean. Never been one to say no. Wilhelmina. It stings. First of all, how dare they? Uh, you need an aqueduct. Uh, no. Both of those are bad. Plus two is fine. Hey, what's up, chicken ace? Okay, let's get a pagoda going here. Harbor A. No. Alright, I wanted a campus district after that. We got a plus three up at the top here. Let's lock that in. Let's get the pagoda first. How are you can how do you continue to elude me? It's an amateur radio call sign. KC zero YGW. Love the surge at all hours. I'll thank you very much, friend. Are you working? Good. All right, uh, so I always want to check if I can put them in further out cities as helps with religious pressure. All right, one more turn and we can do offshore oil. Which is our only option for oil, unfortunately. So I think there's a barbarian encampment up this way. If I settle another city over here, I can grab wine and some other stuff. There we go. In the hierarchy of the major poetic substances. Bonus food from fishing boats. Oh, right. Yeah, I desperately need, desperately need an, uh, an builder up here. As long as we don't lose the Statue of Liberty, everything is fine. Okay, condemn the heretic. We get to do that just for free, which is kind of nice. Dreams, dreams. Where have you gone? We can make Broadway. 
Free random boost. Must be built on flat land adjacent to a theater district. Get rid of rice. Getting rid of rice kind of sucks. 17 turns. It's kind of doable. Now let's just make an amphitheater. Uh, let's get back down this way. Okay, more tunes. How far did I reach with that? Not that far. Okay. All right, oil. Let's go. So with oil coming in, that means, wait, did I lose Nan Medal again? Holy moly. Just <laughs> look how much we've had to invest into this stupid city. Alright, I wanted you there, just in case. I want you... There, I suppose. How do I... Railroad as efficiently as possible? I guess I just go down this way. Condemning the Heretic is a free action? No. Uh, no. No. You need to have at least an action left. I think it's the equivalent of an attack. Okay, that's it. We only get plus six oil per turn. It's a game you're fighting over control of a city-state. You spent about 40 plus envoys. Holy moly. Yeah, having control of the city-state's big for me. It's plus two culture. What the... What are you doing? Oh, I understand. It's plus two culture for every um, district you have that touches water. And that adds up to just such a tremendous amount. But I'm running low. Wait, did you finally... Did I finally get root to you and you changed your job? Religious conversion. Well, but... Unfortunate. Oh, wow. New city. Oh, I guess there's a natural wonder down there, so that makes sense to go grab. I wish with our ally we could see how the war was going. They're sending a catapult in. Alright, there's no room for a catapult in, this, in, the, in these days. Yo! What up, Matt? What up, Wiggins? How are you, my friend? Good evening to you. Good evening to you and yours. You playing some more Final Fantasy Tactics tonight? Yeah, welcome to some late-ish game. Civ 6 right now. Just been having a bunch of fun playing lately and wanted to jam a bit more. Let's just get you a field cannon. You are, and it's so much fun. I'm really glad to hear that. Especially after the, the utter slog that was, uh, wait, oh, I want an archaeological museum. There we go. Belongs in a museum. That was, what was it, Final Fantasy 13 2 or something like that? And you're like, oh my god. Thir wait, 13-3? Tactics has been amazing so far. I'm really glad to hear that. Really glad to hear that. Anyways, hi friends. I'm Serge. We're playing some Civ 6. Having a pretty chill day. The Ottomans? Wait, is that all you... Oh, you have more cities down there. Okay. Uh, there was a new update not too long ago. And yeah, 
We've been having a bunch of fun checking that out. We're going to make some airplanes in a second here. Uh, also, twitch.tv slash Wiggins. My good bud, Matt Wiggins. Uh, the premier authority for streaming all things Final Fantasy. Give his channel a check out. Can Kathleen even play Final Fantasy 13 3? I know she had a really tough time with 10-2. Uh, which, to be fair, I think most people had a hard time with 10-2. Oh, it was also that one? Okay, here's what we need to have happen. We've had two wonders sniped in the past 10 minutes. We just need the Statue of Liberty to complete, and then everything will be amazing. If we also lose that, I don't know what we'll do. Probably cry. Wait. Give me money for no reason. I refuse. No. Oh, the Panama Canal. Sorry, chat. Somebody built the Panama Canal and I'm I'm heartbroken, but yeah, sorry. That's it. Who's the umbrella lady? That is Wilhelmina of the Dutch again. And they just keep texting me over and over, and uh, they're being pretty rude, if I'm honest. Me, 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 me. Give me all your money. That, that's it. Time to restart. No, this is a good game. We're going to win this game. I'd be super excited for 10-2 Remake because it has so many good ideas. They took care of the flaws. I loved 10-2. I thought the dress system was really interesting. Uh, I had a very hard time watching a lot of the cinematics. They took broad... Uh, you'll give me money for peace? Yeah, sure, why not? I'll take your money for free. It was a war I wasn't really involved in. What's the mode for this update and am I using it? Uh, I don't know what it's called and I'm not using it. I typically, I'm pretty slow to adopt new game modes because I just like the base game. Plus five? Are you kidding me? I lose a farm. I lose a farm, but I get a plus five? Wow. Yeah. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Wow, that's a huge amount of production. Huge amount of production. You can just burn more coal, chat. Oh, speaking of which, uh, I need two oil things? I guess I don't have those yet, do I? The new game mode is Dramatic Ages. Right, 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 right. Yeah, Dramatic Ages. You can only have Dark Ages or Golden Ages. No in-between! No slouches in these parts. They weren't making any wonders for ages, and now they're making all of the wonders, and I don't understand why. Oh, that's awkward. The chief incalculable in war. Alright, do I have uranium? Uh, yes. And yes. Well, that's exciting. All right, repair this and then go up there. Am I using any other new Fandango things? Yep, this is Apocalypse and Societies. Yes to both. Geothermal plant's kind of cool. Let's go ahead and grab that. Wait. Uh, convert to oil power. Convert to oil power is good. I have three privateers. Right, because then I want advanced ballistics and that gets me a new thing. Ooh, plus five. Uh, plus five and I don't have to tear down an improvement? Oh, wait, that's actually a six heal. Yeah, never mind. 
yeah, we've been talking about like vampires and all kinds of weird stuff in this game. This is this is a uh, an uh, a secret societies game. All right, I want an oil unit. Actually, I think I can get an oil unit just by improving here. That should give me some more era score. Great. Uh, as soon as this plane is done, that should also give me some era score for flight. Coastal tiles lost. Oh, wow. Hold on. I just noticed. Apparently, storms and floods are now all downside? Storm and floods no longer improve fertility. Huh. I didn't know that stopped at a certain point. Because every time there's a natural disaster, right? It There's an upside. The tile it leave behind gets, an, gets improved. I didn't realize once global warming got bad enough. Things got a little spooky. Okay, we need to try and like rush to the end of the... Um, one of these perk trees so we can start trying to get the improvement there's a um, there's a social thing you can do over and over which lets you reclaim carbon captures or whatever you know and not just burn coal over and over do I want to ramp up trade right now I guess I could yeah let's just go ahead and make a trade thing here Get ourselves another trade route. Start making some money. Uh, three envoys. All right. So why do I keep fighting for this? We're at 297. Three thirty-six. That having suzerain status there is worth forty culture per turn. You could always go nuclear instead of coal. Uh, I don't have the technology for it yet. But I want to do coal plant first, as that does good things for me and my empire. I think I get a uh, an envoy or something like that. I can't remember. You want to become... Okay. What is this? Wait, new uranium? No, I knew that. Hey, we stole more money again. That feels great. Yeah, I don't really care about any of these. Promote the curator. Yeah, I don't care about any of those. The city receives production from all nearby industrial buildings. Not just the first. Okay. That's kind of cool. Void Slingers are culture and loyalty. Yeah. Vo I made a couple of mistakes this game. Uh, one of the mistakes was taking the Void Slingers. Uh, the second mistake was after we started investing in the Void Slingers, we went pretty heavy into religion and fought for that in the early half of the game, which we pretty clearly did not need to. Uh, quartermaster. Better chance to get out. Uh, alliances have expired. Let's just go renew those really quickly. Buddies. Hey, what's up, Basil? You and I have been tight. What? Six? Seven hundred years? What's another undying <laughs> ruler to another, right? Japan, you and I got off on the wrong foot, but at the end of the day, you're not you're not that all that bad. Void Slinger Society, one of your playing Eleanor. The like the loyalty thing is just super weird. I don't know. I just don't maybe I just don't see the value in trying to flip cities. I mean, I can see how it would work. Maybe maybe it's more accurate to say it's just not my play style. I do like the idea that a quartermaster implies the, the existence of a third master and half master. You're, you're absolutely right. All right, let's repair that. Who did I have going back up there? Oh, that was you. Uh, 
Uh, sure, you just chill there. What? Get, get home. You thought it meant the existence of a dime master and a nickel master? That, I mean, that's fair. Also excellent insight. So I've been burning... Yeah, I've been burning the majority of the coal. I just hit coal power and I just started pumping it out. And uh, I think I might be to blame for a little bit of what we're ha what's happening right now. But yeah. it's been a very peaceful game. I'm down for that. Honestly, I get a little I get a little bored of chat being like, haha, warmonger surge. You're like, it's sometimes it's interesting. But it's not the only way I know how to play this game. Yeah, let's go live. Wow, can you imagine how great it would be to live right across from the Great Barrier Reef? Everyone is suffering for your greed. Oh, only a little. Only like the whole planet. What's the biggie? What's the big what's the big problem? But it's a meme now. It is a meme. If you could compare how this game was to a style of coffee, what? Do you mean like Civ Six or this individual game? All right, uh, give me all your money. Wait, I could? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can just steal the inspiration. Is that how that works? Because when you steal, you don't get the full technology. You get the Eureka for it. I need to test this. All right, so when we steal this tech boost, let's see if Taruga gives us... Um, a suzerain, or not a suzerain, an envoy. Very curious about that. Oh yeah, the Dutch hate us. But that's fine, we're going to take all their money. Wow, Japan's army got devastated. Hey, there we go, there we go. A mighty woman with a tool. If it weren't for electricity... We'd all be watching television by candlelight. Sports do not build character. They reveal it. Plus two amenities in each city. Must be built on flat land adjacent to an entertainment complex. Okay, that... We've been struggling for amenities this game. Uh, factory, aquatic center, seaport. How would I describe this game as a coffee? It's been a pretty chill game. Let's just go ahead and call it uh, sort of the V60 of games right now. You know, it's like pretty chill, having a good time. Not really worried about too much, right? Just get to sit down. It's like a nice, easy sipping video game. Pardon me. Oh, I could probably pray for um, flood barriers. That'll be good. Yeah, our science is taking off. 433 right now? That's amazing. Oh, stadiums generate. Hold on. Hold on. Cool. Am I making any more wonders right now? I'm making the Eiffel Tower. All right. We'll keep those cards as they are. You need computers? I got Flood Barrier right there. I'm getting it. It's literally what I just clicked on. Alright, now I think what we do... I don't know if I care about shopping malls. Because... Yep, yeah, don't care. So let's just rocket right ahead into... Future Governance. Yeah, and I think we're going to go for digital democracy here. Uh, ooh, synthetic technocracy is also kind of cool. 
Flat power production in all cities. We don't really care about tourism. Own a rock band. Research robots and genetics. Mm. I think it's synthetic technocracy, actually. We're we building barriers out of microchips. Uh, our, our little baby brains cannot possibly fathom how to protect the reef without over-engineering it. I don't know. I'm sure we can come up with some great lore reason. Uh, let's upgrade you. Oh, that doesn't actually do anything. Right, I already have an oil unit. We'll have a flight unit shortly. I still don't have any archaeologists. Hello! Oh, look, I'm being denounced. That's exciting. I mean, rude, but exciting. Uh, we're going to get this great engineer. Welcome to the team, Tesla. Wait, which city is the largest now? Hey! Alright, our first big city there. Ah, whatever. Trade crew, uh, bleh, trade route capacity has been increased. Let's just go ahead and buy ourselves one of those. Uh, bank. What else am I looking for here? Mm, <clears throat> I think I fixed everything. Natural disaster did wipe out a bunch of stuff here. Trying to make sure I'm not missing anything. I think we're good. In which case, let's go get ready to build a green power source up there. Do ski resorts give amenities as well? Or just tourism? Provides an amenity. I'm at the ski hill. I'm at the volcano. <laughs> the combination ski hill and volcano chat. Good stuff. The World Congress gave me four. Uh, we are absolutely crushing for great person points. Love it. So that puts us at how many points diplomatic? 14. So now I need to start being really careful of diplomatic favor as uh, I'm actually really sad I lost that one wonder. No, snow might be ash. I never even thought about that. The fact that you're just skiing on ash. Jeez. Christ, the Redeemer has been taken. You want to buy my elephants for $14 dues? No, but what about Fox? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, no! Again! Hey, remember a second ago where I was just talking about how I had fixed all the tile improvements in there and how happy I was about that? Yeah, that was great. That was great. <laughs> ah. Good talk. Good. Cool game. Uh, sort by gold. No, it's not gall. Sort by gold. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and trade with Japan. All right, so those are connected. Now, now we go this way. Uh, 
What's that? Steal more money. Don't mind if I do. I'm just going to keep stealing from the Dutch over and over. I'm sure nothing could possibly go wrong. Oh, that's awkward. <laughs> oh, I'm burning a lot of coal here. Ah, it's fine. Hey, there we go. First person to fly. That's a huge amount of error score. And now what we do... All of our cities are going to get flood barriers. All of our cities that can, I should say. Alright, good stuff. Uh, right. Keep advanced ballistics. Let's ignore that for now. I am kind of tempted to launch a satellite. Oh, the biosphere. This is the new wonder. That might be kind of cool to grab, too. All right. Let's just go ahead and repair everything again. Stadium broadcast center. Broadcast center. Okay, welcome home. Right. Wait, hold on. Oh, geothermal plant. Perfect. You just go just live there. Just think about your life choices for a while. Uh, what do I think needs a boost to production? Probably this one, honestly. Oh, wow, you ran. So it should be able to reach up here, which is kind of cool. She's not mad about the spies yet. Well, she doesn't know. Look, that's the beautiful thing about being a master spy. Is no one suspects a thing. So I'm going to use my final charge here to punch a hole through that mountain. Yeah. And I think with that, actually, friends, I'm going to call it a night. It's been three hours. We've gotten a very good chunk of time in sort of this playthrough continuing and I think that leaves us an excellent final chapter the final push which is going to be ooh, what day probably Wednesday Wednesday we'll, be, we'll come back and we'll finish this yeah story in three acts I think is pretty well and also I already did a stream this morning want to make sure I don't get too tuckered we got a long day ahead of us tomorrow so yeah thank you very much for tuning in on this very rare late night stream my friends Hope you enjoyed watching The Adventures of the Gull. And uh, hello to all of you who uh, got to watch at a different time. Hopefully this was this was good. Thank you as well. A lot of evening people stopping by tonight. I want to give a shout out uh, to quite a few folks who rated us, stopped on by. Support your local streaming community, as my good friend Ben would say. Uh, we got twitch.tv slash Wiggins, twitch.tv slash Lair of Lore. Twitch.tv slash suffix, or er, not suffix, shark fists. Oh, they were they were side by side. I'm like suffix doesn't stream. Yeah. Go check them all out. Tomorrow at 9 a.m. We'll be back with more of the vanilla server tour. Checking out the hubris server. So that should be interesting. Since the last time I visited, they definitely crashed the server. Just brought it right down with a massive redstone projects which are all very goofy so it should be pretty neat shout out suffix how dare you the vanity the vanity that's nah, all good uh what else do i normally say at this point thank you for watching thank you for being wonderful thank you for the positivity for supporting me and doing what i get to do and uh yeah i will see you next time and now Speaking of rating, let's find somebody to pass that love on to. Oh, and that's going to be TQ.
So TQ is playing a bit of a spoopy game right now. She's playing some Dead by Daylight with some friends. So bit of a content warner warning. It is a it is more of a horror game, but it's also very popular so far. It's a multiplayer thing. Hey, salt possum with 200 bitties right at the end there too. Thank you. Here are a few extra bits for the night stream. Have a good rest. Thank you so much. So just be a little bit aware of the, the whiplash and content as they have her to TQ, but she's wonderful. Let's go spread some positivity that way. Let somebody know that they are loved. Dead by Day is horror hide and seek. Ah, all right. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.